So guys, in this quick video I'm going to show you how you can uh, customize the toolbar in SketchUp. So the toolbar is this uh, section right up here and uh, you can simply uh, right click and uh, as you can see you have the option to use icon and text or icon only. So as you can see now it's only the icons. I usually keep it icon and text. And uh, the way you customize it is uh, you click on this customize toolbar and um, as you can see you have uh, a lot of options. Um, so these are individual elements. Uh, so for example here we have in the rectangle tool, the rounded rectangle tool, the ovals and uh, so on. So basically um, you have a lot of the options which uh, you usually find in the top menu. And the way you customize it is uh, you can simply uh, click and uh, drag it uh, directly on the toolbar over here. So as you can see, it's uh, automatically updating. And in case you don't want it anymore, you can simply uh, drag it uh, elsewhere and uh, it will disappear. However, it will still be in this uh, uh, menu section. In case you want to um, change the um, current layout to the default one, you can simply um, click and drag this one and it will automatically update it. And uh, I won't do it because uh, um, this is my current uh, uh, preferred toolbar. So yeah, I'll just keep it as it is. But um, yeah, this uh, can be a um, really um, useful time saver if you uh, actually take the time to only add the elements uh, which uh, you like the most uh, and uh, which you'd like to have uh, in this uh, toolbar. Um, that can really save you uh, a lot of time and uh, make your workflow more efficient. So I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I have uh, many more sketch tutorials and uh, UI UX design tutorials on my channel. So yeah, if you have uh, and if you have any questions, uh, just uh, drop a comment below and uh, I'll be happy to get back to, get back to you. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.